Welcome to the open house for the North Grove Street or State Road 19 safety design project. The open house is being held at the Eustis Community Center located at 601 North Shore Drive in downtown Eustis from 5 p.m. to 7 p.m. This presentation will cover a project overview, project features, schedule, ways you can share your comments, and project contacts. The Florida Department of Transportation, or FDOT, has complied with various non-discrimination laws and regulations, including Title VI of the Civil Rights Act and related amendments. The open house is being conducted without regard to race, color, national origin, age, sex, religion, disability, or family status. Persons wishing to express their concerns related to FDOT compliance with Title VI may do so by contacting either Jennifer Smith, Title VI Coordinator for District 5, or Jacqueline Paramore, who is the statewide Title VI Coordinator for FDOT. Both can be reached as shown here. All inquiries or complaints will be handled according to FDOT procedures and in a prompt and courteous manner. This design project is located within the City of Eustis. This project is focusing on the northbound portion of State Road 19 known as North Grove Street beginning at East Floral Avenue and ending at North Eustis Street. The project is about three-tenths of a mile in length. Today, the existing speed limit is 30 miles per hour. North Grove Street is the northbound portion of the one-way pair for State Road 19. There are two travel lanes, each being 13 feet wide. In addition, there are 8.5 foot wide striped shoulders with curb and gutter. Both sides of North Grove Street have a 5-foot wide sidewalk and a 6-foot wide utility strip. South of the curve, there is on-street parking on both sides of North Grove Street. Lake Express, the local transit service, provides bus service along North Grove Street, connecting Eustis to Umatilla. There is a bus stop located south of East Floral Avenue. A safety study was completed in May 2017, noting that there have been 24 crashes from 2011 through 2017, which included one fatality and 10 injuries. The purpose of the design project is to enhance safety for this segment of North Grove Street within the existing right-of-way. The curve will be realigned within the existing right-of-way by increasing the curve radius. As a traffic calming measure, the project will create two 12-foot wide travel lanes by shifting the existing curb and gutter. A 5-foot wide paved outside shoulder will be added. In order to fit these changes within the existing right-of-way, Three on-street parking spaces will need to be removed. Other modifications will include the North Grove Street intersection with State Road 19 and upgraded ADA curb ramps within the project limits. Two features will remain unchanged. The speed limit will continue to be 30 miles per hour and the five-foot-wide sidewalks will remain on both sides of North Grove Street. Impacts during construction will be minimized. Access to properties will continue and construction will occur during the day. During special events, like George Fest, all travel lanes will be open. The design for this project will be completed by early 2020. Construction will begin in summer 2020. No additional right-of-way is needed for this project. Project information and updates are available on centralfloridaroads.com. For the North Grove Street project, select Eustis from the drop-down menu for City and click on Search. Next, click on the Design link. Finally, click on 44137-1. 
the project number for this design project. There are several ways in which you may share your comments with the project team. You may fill out a comment form tonight and drop it in the comments box. You also may take a comment form with you and mail it or email it to Ty Garner as noted on the form. Also, you may submit comments when you visit the Central Florida Roads website. All comments postmarked or emailed by October 7, 2019 will be included in the Open House Summary. If you have any questions or would like more information about this project, you may contact Ty Garner, the FDOT Project Manager, or Dan McCraney, the Project Consultant. Both may be reached either by mail, email, or telephone. Thank you for taking the time to attend this open house. We appreciate your interest and participation in this important project.